Will you donate yourself to science? We need a hundred babies and you are a man. Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. Oh my gosh, in the last episode we gave birth to baby number 88, which was very exciting because it means that we are getting close to ending the series. I keep saying that a lot, but I think I'm just like kind of in shock that this is gonna end soon because I've been doing it for like two years plus, I think. This series was honestly the thing that kind of got my channel going. I'm gonna feel super sad when it's gone, you know? Super sad. In today's episode, I wanna get Tristan a boyfriend finally because he deserves it. Um, we also need to get his skills up and his homework done. So he likes his logic. I tried to do it on the last episode but I just couldn't get it going because he was in a super bad mood all day. So let's put the toddler to bed. We can also get Casey up to age this baby. It's about time this baby grew up even though it was born in the last episode. But what I do is I have a baby and then I grow it up so that is what we're going to do today. Come on! Oh my gosh a, a ghost sent Hayden a gift. Ooh, let's give him independence. Oh wow, he's actually adorable. I love him. I love him so much. Right, so let's go get Casey to make some food. Oh wait, there's already food here. That's good. I'm gonna put that in my inventory. Maybe everybody can grab a bowl. If you're hungry, come and grab yourself a floor salad. Delicious. Tristan starts school in an hour. Oh gosh, has he even done his homework? No. He's the worst student. Have any of the kids done their homework? They haven't? What is happening here? Why is nobody doing their homework? All of these children are bad. Maybe it's me being a bad sim parent. Okay, so that's the kids off to school with their homework finally done and then it's just left with Casey because the toddlers are asleep, which is great. Thank goodness for that. There's finally peace and quiet in this household. Seven sims in the house, which means we can get pregnant to someone else. You know what? I might fire the butler. That's the thing I might do. Where is he? Where did you go? Let's fire him. I don't know how, but that's what I want. Butler. Fire. There we go. I'm sorry, you're going to lose your job. Please don't fall out with me. I still love you. And as soon as he's left, what we're going to do is we're going to ring him and tell him to come back over because this mama needs some loving. Oh my gosh. People have gone up with their grades. Congratulations, everybody. That is what we want. That is what we need. Everybody to do well at school. We should probably ring the butler over. Naoki. Oh, what? Can we not do anything with him? What the heck? It's like he's not a real sim. I honestly feel like we can't do anything with him because he's a butler. That sucks so much. We can never be with our one true love. So sad, actually. Well, maybe we should find a new man. Also, I asked you guys to submit some men for Tristan and you guys did super well. Look at all of these amazing submissions. I'm liking the look of this guy. He's cute. Oh my gosh, and he's a vampire. That's pretty cool. He's a vampire, but he wants to be human. He's looking for a loving boyfriend. <laughs> I love that. He's super cute. And this one's cute too. Which one is your favorite for Tristan? Let me know in the comments section down below. Take note of their name. And in the next episode, we shall move one of them into the town and we shall hook them up with Tristan. But for now, he needs to focus on his grades. I find it awesome after two years, I still have active viewers watching this series. I think that's crazy, but cool. Oh my gosh, look at her playing on a little kitty iPad thing. It's so cute. I can't deal with it. What are you doing in there, boy? Just gone into the closet. He's crying, why? Privacy invaded. Sims don't like having someone walk in on them. Oh no. I think somebody walked into the bathroom while he was in there. That's awkward. Tristan, are you okay? You just stood there in the bathroom. What's going on? Oh, now he's off to school. Oh, hello, Salem. Just letting yourself into the house, I see. Nobody invited you in, but I guess that's okay. Trying to find time to get with a man while you are super tired and constantly pregnant. And looking after a bunch of children is not easy. You know what though? I really like Salem. Maybe he could be the one. He's also cooking something. What are those? Seriously, what is that? It looks good. Macarons, <laughs> what? What a random thing to just make. Honestly, we need to find a man and a man quick. Is 
there anyone around? Should Owen invite over classmate Santiago? Okay. Yes. Invite over your friends. It's fine. I have not had a child with this man. Hello. Diego. Wait, where did he go? Diego, come back. This is a man on a mission. What the heck? Stop. We want to talk to you. Oh my gosh, he likes it. Good. This is moving on quick. Let's kiss his hands. Let's go straight in there. Will you donate yourself to science? We need a hundred babies and you are a man. Let's do a flirt with him. Just stare at him in the eyes. Really awkwardly. Oh, he's feeling flirty too. This is good. Hopefully we don't fall asleep on him. Oh yes, we can do a first kiss. Quick, we're falling asleep. No, he's leaving. You can't leave. We need a first kiss. Yay. We just met you on the street and now we are kissing. Oh wait, I, oh, we're just leaving. Okay, that's fine. He's just talking to himself. Okay, he's gone. Well, we should probably go to sleep anyway because we're super tired. We can invite him around tomorrow. Oh, poor Tristan is feeling flirty. He just doesn't have anyone to flirt with. Sophia's here, but he doesn't like girls. I think she has a massive crush on him as well, which is awkward. Some other kid friend Owen and took his lunch money. He's been crying in the office. Oh my gosh, I have more than one option this time. Find the kid or I will. He needs to stand up for himself. Let's tell them to find the kid or I will because I'm sick of my child being bullied. Casey Zimmer is invited Owen school and how to deal with the situation. Ooh, okay. I don't know whether those options are bad or good because most of the time they increase one thing but decrease the other. Why do I feel like Casey is just always tired all the time? Anyway, we need to invite Diego over. Hopefully he's available. Oh my gosh, is Tristan a great A? He is! Oh, we can age up some sims today. How exciting. But before we do, some of our sims have got to have a little nap. Oh, he's here. So fast. Hello. Oh, why are you in a bad mood? Are you okay? Oh, no, he's really not. Oh, gosh, he's very angry. What if we kiss him? He is so moody today. What the heck? Okay, what if we just say, let's try for a baby. We've got our levels up pretty high now. Oh, we're going in the closet. Oh my gosh, Tristan's asleep. No, Tristan is literally asleep right there. Okay, well, I hope he doesn't wake up because he will be traumatized. Hopefully we are pregnant. Let's see. Come on, is there a baby in there? Because this guy's in a bad mood. Yay, we are pregnant. Where is he? Let's go tell him. Hopefully this puts him in a bit of a better mood. Just announce it in front of everyone. Hey, that's good. I think he's in a good mood. Right, let's go to sleep because we're tired. Oh wait, we gotta repair the jukebox and then go to sleep. It's a good job Salem left. Okay, we're gonna get Tristan to make a birthday cake because we need to age up some of our Sims. Awesome, so Tristan can age up first because he is the oldest. How exciting. He's moving on in his life. Next episode, he'll have his own boyfriend. I'm so proud of him. So let's have romantic because he really needs to get his man. Let's add the candles again. The next sim to age up is Isaac. So let's get him down here to blow out the candles. And I actually think that's the final sim to age up. Just the two of them. Here we go. This is gonna be so much easier now having like three capable sims that can do some jobs around the house. And Isaac is all grown up. So he's gonna be knowledgeable. And a genius. Oh my gosh, look who it is. Faith has come to visit. Tristan, invite this girl in. Let's give her a loving hug. Faith actually had a baby of her own called Gloria. How cute. Anyway, guys, I think this is where I'm going to leave today's episode. Things have gone right for us and everybody seems to be in pretty good moods, apart from the kids who are always hungry all of the time. Yeah, I'm trying to get some of the kids' grades up, but apart from that, I'm just gonna wait until next episode where we can focus on Tristan finally getting the boyfriend of his dreams. Anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed it, do make sure to leave a like. Also, leave a baby name suggestion down in the comments section below, and make sure to vote for your favorite boyfriend of Tristan. If you can't remember the names of them, just skip back to the video, and hopefully you can find them. But I hope you're all having a wonderful day, and I will see you guys in the next one.